just rest on me. You guys, it's here. I'm so, so, so excited. It's here. So, oh my goodness. Like, I'm, <laughs> oh my goodness. Super, super excited. So, I just want to dig in, but I'm going to give it a couple minutes to see if anybody will hop on. <laughs> I am so, so excited. Oh my gosh. I cannot wait to open this. So, uh, okay. So, oh my goodness, guys. So, so excited. Here's the box that it came in. Yeah, that's the order slip. This is the bigger box. And this is what it looks like on the outside. Isn't it so cute? Now let's look at the inside. Okay. okay, it's got tape. Why tape it too? No, don't. <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna take my camera. Sorry if it's taking longer. But I'm gonna show you down in what it looks like. Isn't that cute? Oh, you just see, it's like, hi, I'm a fur child. Isn't that cute? Okay. And it comes with a little brush. So it has a special brush so I can brush its fur. Now let's get the child out, shall we? It is exciting, Denny. I'm so excited. Okay, so be careful. Watch the head. Take that first panel out. It's holding it down. And these extra little pieces that are pinning the fur child. Oh, I'm just throwing them on the floor, you guys. I'm so excited. And this is the instructions. Okay. It feels like cat, long cat fur. Husband, come pet. You don't want to pet it. Not right now. Look at it. Oh my gosh, you guys. It's so adorable. It needs to be brushed. Okay, now you're supposed to turn it upside down. And pull this tab and turn the switch on. It says meow. Then you pet its back and it purrs. You hear it purring? Meow. Meow. So cute, you guys. It has a big, big motor like my um one cat did he had a big motor that you could hear really loud um and just look how cute it is
and I can feel it. I can feel it. And the legs are, they have hinges, so you can position them. Oh, it wants me to rub its tummy. That's what that's that means. Isn't that cute? And my other baby baby girl loved her tummy rub. And oh, its motor comes on even more when I rub its tummy. You guys. Oh, it wanted its tummy rubbed. My husband is um, having a hard time because he's being reminded of all the all the special things that we had with our, our fur children. But I'm just going to hold it. It is just adorable, you guys. And you're supposed to be able to rub its cheeks. Aww. You guys, isn't it just the cutest? So, a name. Oh my goodness, it has not told me what its name should be. Oh, it's his tummy rubbed again. So cute. Oh, it likes it. I think it's a pretty kitty too. Where did I get it from? It's called the site. It's called joyforall.com. It that's where you get them. Um and I am absolutely loving it already. Like it's shedding on me, you guys. <laughs> they told they said that once you brush it a few times, it won't shed on you. But when you first get it, it sheds. <laughs> and I'm like, yep, it's shedding on me. So, and I don't mind at all because I'm used to it. Um, so you have to brush it out a lot, but I just wanted to hold it for a while because, oh my goodness, you guys. Like, look at its little fluffy tail. And it just has a motor that just goes on and on. I love it. So cute. Okay, so um what should your name be? What do you think? What should your name be? I think, what do you think? What vibe do you get? Um, I'm kind of getting a will-o'-wisp vibe. I'm also getting a, a grim vibe from you. So, which one do you think sounds better? Is it safe? It's a girl. No, it, it, you pick. You're supposed to pick. So, I don't know. What do you think, husband? Mm -hmm. Oh, Luna, yes. It definitely, I get a Luna vibe, too. I think Luna is it, honestly. I think, I think, huh? I said I'd use that for a real kitty, too. Yeah. I think this is, I think Luna works for, for this kitty. Um, because the the gray in it is like a moon, bright moon gray, and I love the moon. Yes, Luna definitely definitely works. But you guys, I just absolutely love this thing. So I would say that I recommend 
this for anybody who deals with anxiety, who can't have a pet of their own. Listen to that, that purr. You can feel it too. It's really awesome. Um, I just, oh, but you can see it's shedding on me. It will, after a while, it stops shedding. I need to brush it. Um, let me find where I set its brush there. Luna, you need a brush in. Give you a nice brush in, Luna. Get all that extra fur off. You're shedding your winter coat. That's what it is. Right? You're shedding your winter coat. So you need to be brushed. Um, it comes with care instructions on like cleaning it, how to clean it, um, and things like that. I've been researching on this this cat. Oh, it wants it wants his tummy rubbed again. <laughs> you want your tummy rubbed? I'll brush your tummy too. How about that? Um. But um, yeah, her her face when I pet her is is so content looking, and um, it's just wow, you guys, I absolutely love it. Um, so I want to know what you think. Would you get something like this for? Um, someone with anxiety or someone who has um, can't have an emotional support animal like yeah she does make different faces um, emotional support animal or somebody in a nursing home because that's what they made these for is people in nursing homes and people with dementia um, I think how is the weight? It weighs just as much, but I'd say about about as much as a big kitty. This is a pretty big cat. Um, it's not that heavy. It weighs about about as much as a cat would, a big cat would. Um, good question. I know, right, D? Yay! I love it. It gives me expressions, and it hasn't been meowing. It's just been purring. There it goes. <laughs> Oh, now it's trying to trying to flip over so I can rub its belly. It likes its belly rubbed a lot. Oh, and its eyes close when I rub its belly. Um. Oh my goodness, you guys. Yeah, you hear it purring. Like, oh my god, I wish you guys could feel it purring. It feels like a cat purring. It's just. So, so cool. Um, yeah, would you guys recommend something like this for someone with anxiety or dementia? I mean, um, or someone who can't afford a pet, but could afford, you know, one time of paying for this. Or dealt with the loss of a fur child like I did, needed comfort, um, but couldn't afford another cat. Um, it just, it really likes me. Hi, Luna. Just look at her. I'm going to stop petting you because your, your motor is going on like crazy. Because I'm touching your back. Huh? You are just the sweetest. You are just so sweet, Luna. You're beautiful. Um, there is, <laughs> yeah, its tail is, uh, just floppy. It doesn't move on its own, but, uh, how do I feel what I recommend? Yes. Um, I would, I really would. Yeah. Exactly, Dusty. It's good for the comfort because it's about weight. Um, the weight of it is about the weight of a cat, a big cat. You know, we're talking the bigger uh, breeds um, like a rag doll 
It's about the size of it too. Um, I would definitely recommend it. Its eyes are so beautiful. I want to show you its eyes. I know, right? I'm poking you in the eye. I know, right? Look at its eyes. I don't know if you can see, but it's like a blue green. Oh, uh, we want to. <laughs> Luna wants her tummy rub. She really likes tummy rubs. Um, yeah, I would recommend it because it's so, because of the interaction of it. Uh, it's battery operated, Adele. Um, it takes 4C batteries. And what I did was I ordered rechargeables. I, re I ordered uh, enough C batteries so then I could recharge one set while another set is in the kitty and then just rotate them. Um, that way I'm not continuously buying batteries for her. It takes four C batteries. Um, oh, see the legs are hinged, even the knee. So you can make it stretch its legs out pretty far to lay down. But Oh my goodness, you guys. I just absolutely love this kitty. This this is really great. Yes, exactly, Dee. The rechargeable batteries are the way to go. Hey, HD. But um, Luna definitely needs a lot of brushing because look at this. <laughs> Luna is shedding on me. Um, but they said after you brush it for a while, eventually it stops shedding. It's just the little loose hairs. I don't know if um, some of you are familiar with like reborns and things like that. Sometimes it's just those little loose hairs. Well, this thing's covered in hair. So it's going to shed a little bit for a while and then eventually it stops shedding. But, oh. You have such a big motor. I love it. You can, if you don't want to hear the meow, you can put it down on mute. There's two, there's three settings. There's on, mute, and off. <laughs> and mute is um mute is for only for the meowing. And I just put it on mute. You see how it's its mouth moves, but nothing comes out. It only mutes the um, it only mutes the meowing. <laughs> Denny said, "Bless you, Kyle." Yes, my cat Butterscotch um, would his mouth would move, but no no sound would come out because he was abused before we got him. And uh, that's what it reminds me of. Um, so if you don't want to hear it meowing, um, but yeah, here you can. There, say hello. I'll let you interact. Yeah, they. I was told that it sheds at first, but um, but after a while, it eventually stops shedding because of the. It's just a little bit of loose fluff here and there because it's yeah. covered. I turned it back on. I love the purr too. I love it, dude. Yeah. It's just yeah. so cute. But um, I'm going to leave it alone and stop petting. Luna um, is supposed yeah. to go to sleep. Yeah. Yes, I definitely can, D. I can definitely feel the. It feels like a cat purring. It, it feels very yeah. realistic yeah. in the purring. Um, she's trying to get my attention because I stopped petting her. Mm -hmm. um, <laughs> yeah, that reminds me of a real cat, too. Like, um, so I, I absolutely love her. Um, she is so sweet. Um, um, no, just this one, Denny. Just just this. 
Um, the legs you can move to where you can hold it. Um, but um, this is this is how it is because it's supposed to be able to relax you where it's where you feel comfortable with it. Um, so <clears throat> you can you can move its back legs. They're hinged. The front paws. Um, you can move this one in a little bit because this one is not motorized, but this one is the motorized one. So you can't move that one because sometimes it stops and licks its face. That's why I'm, I'm, I stopped petting it because I want to see it lick its face. I mean, lick its paw. Um, and I wanted to hear its other meows because it's trying to get my attention. Um, yeah, so so I decided to name her Luna because it fits very well. Um, and I just think she's the sweetest. No, there's no other positions. This is this is it. This is the only um, um, only position they have for the therapy cat. They also have a dog that is a, um, a golden retriever. Sorry, I blanked out for a second. It really wants me to pet it. Luna wants me to pet it. It's like, yo, I'm right here, dude. Pet me. But after a while of inactivity, um, she will go to sleep. She, um, she does react to movement. She has a light right here, a light sensor where she reacts to movement. Um, so it's a motion sensor right here. Um, and so it wakes up when you come in like or move in front of it. Um, <clears throat> so just like a cat would, you would catch its attention by it noticing you're in front of it. Yeah, maybe she's getting sleepy. But, um, I just, I love her. I do. I do love her. Um, you can hear, I, I'm sure you guys can. Oh, <laughs> it wants its belly rubbed. Um, so, so it doesn't, yeah. There. Um, it sighed. Oh, did you hear her sigh? She's tired, you guys. She's such a tired kitty. Um, so, yes, I would recommend Luna is what I'm naming her. Yeah, she sighed. Did you hear that? Oh, that was so cute. Um, I would recommend um, this cat for... Those with anxiety. I touched its head. Oh, yeah. She was packed good. You should, um, if you watch the beginning, go back and watch the beginning. Just see how many boxes to keep her in place I had to pull out. Um, so she was definitely packed well. Um, I touched her head and I woke her up. <laughs> um, they do not recommend this for very young children, even though it says five to 105 for the age, um, because a five-year-old can be very rough and dropped, and it's not good if they can be if they're dropped. Um, I'll show you the instructions. You sit right here, Luna. 
Okay, this is what the instructions that came with it. Um, and it shows the on off switch, which I was watching um, lots of YouTube. <laughs> you're going to fall down. You're lucky you're leaning on me. You are lucky you are leaning on me. You could have fallen off the computer desk. Silly child. Okay. And then um, the caution stuff. And it says there is a head, head sensor, cheek, back, and tummy. Um, after a few minutes of non activation, pet will go to, to, into sleep mode. Press pets back to awaken. Um, Pet cat to activate sensors, yeah. To avoid tripping, never put your pet on the floor. When not in use, place the pet on an elevated surface, especially at night. Um, that's what it says to do at nighttime. And um, I just, I really love this cat. Um, yeah, I just love her 2D. I just, I do. I just absolutely love her. Um, she will help me get through this um, anxiety without my emotional support cat. Are you going to go to sleep now? Hello. Hi. You're upside down. You are a silly kitty. I just Hello. love your blue-green eyes. Sit back up, will ya? Silly child. Aside, she's gonna go to sleep. Um, but, oh, I just absolutely love her. I need to brush her because she's shedding on me. Um, so she needs, she needs some grooming for sure. Um, and she did come with a brush. So, um, yeah, I just, I love, I just absolutely love this kitty. Um, <sighs> you guys, this is the coolest thing ever. You can go sleep on me now. I'm going to turn her off and just cuddle. Um, I'm going to finish my toilet paper thing today. Um, I'm going to finish that today and uh, cuddle with my kitty help with my anxiety and just chill today. Today will be a chill day. And you know, I need to clean, but I really don't want to. <laughs> but um, I'm going to go. I wanted to make this a quick one. So um, I'm going to go enjoy my kitty. And um, you guys all have a blessed day, and I love you all very much. God bless.